Uh, today we're talking about the trash that we're starting to see abandoned here in the uh, valley, in the foothills. Propane tanks, trailers, scrap metal, um, junk, aerosol cans, garbage. Over here we got poles from a trampoline, uh, some of these tree branches, they could have just probably just burned them, parts of a mattress. Oh gosh, don't forget the box springs. We got the box springs here. We've got some sheets. We got a mattress. Oh gosh, look at that. Would you look at that? Now, who would this belong to? Oh dang it. It's prescription pills. Out of all things, prescription pills. Why we got these sitting here? That's, we've got drugs sitting right here. Really? What else is in this bag here that shouldn't be here? Crayons! Mom, I didn't forget my crayons. Now I can draw a picture. Pink picture. Let's see here. More pills and gather up her garbage. That would be awful nicely of her. These are uh, do not use after 7-14-2020. Love and refills by the 7-1 of 20. Oh, I don't know what these are for, but let's see here. That's a whole bottle full of them. Huh, there's pills there. Some more, some more pills. Uh, I don't know, these are blue ones. Those ones were white ones. Those ones were white ones. Chin. Uh, Valcosa Gulliver, one gram tabs. Take two tablets by mouth two times a day. I don't know what these are for. This medicine may be taken with food or without food. Uh, dizziness, do not drive or use while driving. Uh, yeah, it's just junk. I don't know why she just didn't throw it away in her trash can at home or whatnot, but who knows? Maybe it wasn't her who dropped them off, but the thing is, is why is it here you know i don't want to dig do much more in that bag because it's got some kind of a two uh, feeding tube or whatnot right there or something i uh, just you know I, I i don't know i ain't gonna say any more on that but whoever it is or whoever that is i ain't come and get it hey Joe. I found your, uh, your uh, insurance offer from Progressive out here. But anyways, you know, I see tires out here. If I get cold tonight because the wife's going to kick me out of the house, I'm sleeping in the doghouse because I'm doing another video. I got a blanket here I can hide underneath the overpass for shelter. And I won't freeze tonight because I got a blanket. I'll even be able to sleep comfortably tonight because I've got a mattress and a box springs. But you know, we're starting to see a lot of this crap abandoned around Sevier County. We got a match, another mattress clear over there, a box springs or a mattress clear over there uh, that's abandoned, that people just dropped out and threw it out here because they don't want to haul it to the dump because now you have to pay $29 a ton to dump at the bench charge you $29 just to dump at the dump but it goes off the weight so if it didn't weigh the full ton it, you're not paying the $29 so it's kind of however much so it's basically prorated or whatever you want to call it but if you figure know how that works then you understand but still 
It's a lot easier just to bring it out here in the foothills and pollute our beautiful valley with your garbage, with your trash. That trash is pretty disgusting because it looks like a poop bag that's in that bag with the feeding tube or something. It's just an adult diapers. I don't need to touch any more of it. It's bad enough just touching what I was touching right there, but you know, it's sad. You know, especially if you're gonna bring that out and drop off your meds for little kids to come out here and get into that have no idea what it is. That's pretty disgusting too. And then you leave your name on there. So whoever is, maybe come and gather your stuff up. That would be highly uh, thankful of you, but it is what it is. But you know, banded trailer out here. That trailer right there, man, I could take and pick it up and put a deck on that and turn around and uh, sell it for a hundred bucks, two hundred dollars, three hundred dollars, just whatever one somebody wants to give me for it. But it, it's just ridiculous. Over there at the sawdust pits, we'll go over there. We've got a refrigerator. It's over there that's been dumped over there. You know, I, I just don't understand. Put it out into your trash can. I don't understand why they couldn't put that stuff in the trash can that is her garbage. I could have just went into the garbage can. Uh, scrap metal. You could have taken your scrap metal to the recycling place and they would have given you $10 or $20 for trailer and all that used tires or junk tires you could have probably waited till they did the free tire recycling every once a year or whatnot and could have dumped that off when they take the free tires but no we bring it out here and dump it off here and leave it here to trash the beautiful valley but anyways we'll uh go over there and do a little bit of short clip over there and like they say the women don't find you handsome they ought at least find you handy. And like Paul Harvey would say, now you know the rest of the story. <laughs>